This is called discover check with the bishop. King has got space here. Is it? Is it that? That looks promising. There. King can't come to this square, so he has to come to this square. The queen is then in line. White square bishop is covering this, so we get the queen off the board. If it is it is it that? Because I don't think. Let's have a look. So we go there. So we go up, we've got the check on, king comes down, and because we have the bishop here, if we then attack the check, the queen takes, the rook, the bishop takes, the queen, and the king takes the bishop. And then we would have one rook. So that can't work. That's not it, is it? That is definitely not it. It looks nice, but we lose out. So there must be something else. Oh, look at this move. <laughs> and they're looking at these old complications. And it's just here. Step ladder. So they will lose the queen because then we can push this bishop here. And it's all done, isn't it? Dear me. Yeah, so... I believe it is the pawn push with the check on the king now. And it's all done because the bishop comes in and does it again. Voila! Nice one. It's good to talk. Nice one. Right, I find the best move for black. For black, bishop. King looks a little bit jammed in here. I think it's a simple pawn pushing, isn't it? Oh, is it? It does escape. Attack the king. Can't come. Can't go there because the bishop's blocking. Only space is here. Oh, then he loses the rook. Rook comes down and then he loses his rook. That must be it, mustn't it? Push. Yeah. He definitely can't go anywhere else. He loses the rook. It has to be that. Yeah. That, oh, he's got the bishop though. Hold on. Let's think. Bishop for the rook. Uh, maybe there's something else. Damn it. I thought that was it. Well, we do have these two pawns. He would lose a rook. Then he takes... So in essence though, if you look at it, we've we're regaining power because we've got two pawns and he's got one rook after all of that. So I think we'll just take yeah. And then they take and then we've got the pawns which should get promoted at some point. Find the best move for white. Ooh, for white. Well, that's an interesting situation because you could just go like this. This king is far down there, isn't it? If we don't go there, he comes here, so he's going to be hounding our pawn. So it's probably best pushing the pawn onto his pawn. You'd think he would take. If he did take, then the king can take. And then we're leading. His king is far behind. So probably try and come across here. By which time we're already up. It'll be too late to get our pawn. So I think it's just a simple pawn push. Oh! Damn! Hold on, we'll look at the continuation after. So let's... I'm going to view the solution. I'm not going to overthink this thing. It was the king move up. That was the first move I said. And I thought, well, they can come round the back. 
Is that when he do, does the pawn push? I'm thinking, the, oh, and that was my thought of going here, here, but I'm thinking he's going to get this pawn. Let me just play it out. So we've gone there, go here, he comes up. Oh, it's still continuing taking the pawn. And then he takes this pawn, takes. Ah, because the king is going to be supporting the pawn and the king is at the back. Ah, oh, nice one. In fact, that's a nice little bit of a lesson there. Let's just take it back to the move that I made. Where was it from? There. Is that where his king is? No, that's right. His king is there. And I said push this. Ooh, it said draw. What's all this fancy business? Okay, we'll go with the biggest form. And then I said probably take him here like this. And he's going here. And I would probably go up. Not sure about any of that. Go there. There. Oh yeah, he's going to get to block it off, isn't he? So we take. He comes in. And the king can never get out of here. Yeah, so he just blocks it off. Right, fair enough. Fair enough. Well, that was a... Out of all of the puzzles that we've done this week, this is the one that's given a little bit of a snippet of a lesson. Excellent. Find the best move for black. For black? Well, you would think it would go for a promotion, wouldn't you? But surely it can't be that simple because it's got... It's got checks on my king coming in. If the king moves up, it's got checks on my king coming in. It's like there's a whole world of hurt coming on. So if we put a check on his king, gets his king away from supporting the queen attacking our king, he can't go here and he can't go there. He can't go here. So he can go there or he can go... No, he can't go there because the rooks has got the check on. So he either comes here or he comes there. One of those one of those two spots. If our rook comes across. And what does that mean to us? It gives us time to actually get a queen. Without any disturbance. Because his queen can't come here because the pawn will take. The rook can take the pawn, but the queen will just take the rook. So I think that's what it is. Rook putting a check on the king. Oh, we got a tick. And then we can go and get promoted. Yes! Nice one. Find the best move for white. What do we have? Simple capture. Takes, takes, uh, oh, nice little four going here, but it does have like a two-fold attack here, so I think we have to, we either have to take the rook, or is there some magical thing that I'm missing, maybe the rook here, I don't think we would do that. Take the rook's own in the file, so that is kind of key, isn't it? Rook's all in the file, but then we can bring the knight here and we're attacking both pieces. And you can actually come back and defend the bishop, but then he gets taken. So we'll win one of the pieces for free. Take, and then the knight comes here and we take the rook. Excellent. 